After the initial setup of the TaxAct Professional software, you may further set up and customize your program from the Preparer menu in the program. First, let's select Preparer from the menu bar, then Master Information, then Practice to open the Master Information window. Your company information, such as your company name and address, is entered in the Practice tab. Text entered in the Practice Master Information will be used to automatically populate your company information on applicable forms in the program. Next, click the Preparers tab on the left. In the Preparer Information window, you may add additional preparers or edit existing information. Please note that each preparer in your practice should sign into the TaxAct program with their own unique TaxAct username and password. If you need assistance with setting up additional preparer accounts, see our instructional video on this topic. Next, click the Client Status tab on the left. This tab allows you to add, edit, or delete options for the Client Return Status column and the Client Pay Status column that display in the Client Manager. If you chose the option to store your data locally during the initial program setup, you will also see a Security tab on the left. The Security tab offers additional program and user-level security options. For example, you may set permissions so a preparer can only prepare returns but not e-file, prevent a preparer from deleting existing returns, and much more. If you selected the option to store your data on TaxAct servers during the initial setup of the program, you will not see a security tab in the Master Information window as permissions are managed from the Preparer entry in the Preparer Master Information. Next, click the Directories tab on the left. If you are using the Enterprise Edition of the program, you may specify default directories for TaxAct files. If you selected the option to store your data locally during the initial program setup, you may select a shared network location for your client data directory in order to share the same master information and client returns between all computers in your office. Next, click the General tab on the left. The General Master Information allows for further customization to assist in simplifying the return preparation process based on your preferences. Close the Master Information window, then click Preparer from the menu bar, then Preferences to access additional Preparer preferences. In the Client Manager tab in the Preferences window, you may set which columns are displayed in Client Manager and in what order they display. If you chose the option to store your data locally during the initial program setup, you will see an Appointment Manager tab where you may customize the Appointment Manager. The Miscellaneous tab offers further client manager and program customization to tailor the program to your personal preferences. Click the Save and Exit button in the bottom left corner to save your preference changes and return to the client manager. This concludes our video on setting up and customizing your program. Be sure to check out our additional training videos on setting up master billing invoicing, adding additional preparer accounts, and more.